Hi friends, time for more morning coffee. <laughs> Actually, it's the same day. Uh, I'm just editing part two and parts three of the video. This is part two, and part two is the rest of the tour of the Empire Ranch House. And if you didn't see the first part of the ranch house and the drive out here, I'll try to put a card right up there. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Oh my gosh, look at this living room. Yeah, look at the view. I know, that's what I love. This is the favorite kitchen and my favorite living room. <laughs> this room. <laughs> we signed it, me and Beautiful. Mike signed it when we came. Hey, looky here. See those books? Yeah. I have a hundred of them. Is that Walden? That set. <laughs> uh, uh, Henry David Thoreau. It sure is Walden. Yeah. <laughs> you can come in here and just read these sometimes. <laughs> the cribbage board. Hmm. I've never seen fireplaces on the ground. And a dictionary. Oh, this will be gr this will be fun. This will be really fun. I have an old dictionary from like 1908. Mm -hmm. And it says in it that a gorilla... Is a le is a mythical creature. Really? Hold the camera. Let's look up gorilla. Wow. You gotta be really careful with these old books. Very careful. I love the pictures now. Uh, gorilla would be under G. Is that right? Wait a minute. <laughs> this is not. <laughs> it's, it's not a dictionary. <laughs> It's a Bible. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Never mind. It's so much easier to clean the fireplace out on the ground like that. I had a fireplace. Um, like that? In our big white house in Portland, we had four fireplaces. Oh. And they all had holes in the bottom so that you could just scoop it in there. And then down in the basement, where there was a door you could open up and take it all out. Well, that's neat. Yeah. Uh, all three of them had that. One of them in the master bedroom didn't have um, that because it wasn't built for wood. It was built for coal. This is our favorite bathroom. This is your favorite bathroom. <laughs> There's another fireplace. This is so cool. I, and look how thick the walls are. So this is probably ad Adobe. Or, look how thick the wall is. It's like yeah. two and a half feet thick. Yeah. This is your favorite bathroom. Uh-huh. I've always wanted a bathtub like that. Yeah. But you, I want it to be outside. You're <laughs> probably tired of me saying things like I used to have one. I don't know what it's called. I think there's shoes and everything. Let's see. Oh, nothing. They took the shoes out. There used to be a pair oh, of shoes up there. It's a walk-in closet. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's some of the hat boxes and stuff still here. Yeah, there used to be a pair. It might, the shoes might be in a, another cute room. Isn't it crazy? And this is all natural from an on pole, on pole. Oh, sure. Wow. Oh, yeah, this, is, this is all natural in the paint. Hot, cold, hot, cold. It naturally does this. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah, it'll take a few years to get that effect. This, right? is, this is the night that, when, this is the room that at night it's a little creepy. And when it gets dark. <laughs> this place just keeps going and going and going. There's an Arizona room out there. Oh, Isn't that beautiful? Kids out here. Mm. Oh, that's why it would have been creepy. Yeah. They, hey, baby, the two kids they had when me and you and Mike came, staying in the corner, they took the dolls out of the corner. And this is the closet. That's oh, the closet. Okay. No dolls. Doll house. You see, this is an access. Here. Barnyard. Set. Another, it's another walk in closet. Come on, I got a laugh last time. I know. <laughs> There's a better walk in closet. Oh, that's a real walk in closet. Oh my gosh. This is where I saw a ghost. So you saw a ghost in here? Right he here. He saw a ghost. Okay. 100% sure. Okay, well. I don't believe in ghosts. Uh, we took off and left immediately. Really? Yes. Well, apparently the ghost is not. Oh! 
Gotcha. <laughs> I, s- uh, I walk in this room. Yeah. It was bright, bright, bright white. Really? In that corner, and it was deeper. I swear, it wasn't just ending right there. But it didn't look like a ghost. It was just white, wispy, really bright, like a cloud or something. But it creeped me out. I saw it. I'm like, it was way brighter than anything in here. And I took off. I'm like, I'm gone. Uh, it was very dark and overcast. The whole house was dark. That's pretty freaky. Yeah. And I don't believe in ghosts. I left the meeting. So what's the deal with this? You got to cover up something. Yeah. Got to cover up nothing. Baby? So we put the baby? No. It's kind of human. Oh, I know what it is. It's a changing table, and you put the chamber pot where you put the diapers down there, and you have a little curtain so that it doesn't fumigate the room. Yeah. (laughs) Especially since we're right next to the dining table. (laughs) Oh, is this another room I haven't been in? Yeah. Another clawfoot bathtub. Ah, a bedroom. There's a ghost in this closet. It's a lady's wear. (laughs) Oh, you got dressed again. (laughs) (laughs) Yes, I did. (laughs) Yeah, they they took, it looks like they rotated some things around. Hanging on the... A little heart pillow on the bed. Uh oh. A locked door. Now what are we gonna do? Uh oh. 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 Ah, the Arizona room. You know, it's actually ten degrees warmer right in here. It is. Yeah. That's a camp post job. That's a nice job. What's this? This is this electrical wiring hanging down. Oh, look here. You can see what uh, it's made out of. It is. It is Adobe. Look at that. It's plastered Adobe. That's why the walls are that thick. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, did we close that door? Yeah, yes. good. <clears throat> Lock the door. Whoop! And the porch. Welcome to the historic Empire House, Empire Ranch House, 160 acre homestead by William Wakefield. Oh, yeah, good. it's rosemary. It smells so good. So you take a sprig of this. And roll it in your fingers. Well, you put it in your chicken when you roast it. Oh, yeah, yeah. They smell so good. Mm-hmm. So I need to plant one of these. Yeah. They yeah. It's crazy out here, baby. Look at the rosemary. Two and, big old bushes in the front. And this here... No, this was basil. Oh, basil, yeah. Basil. That's for, yeah, it's probably a little wow. hot for it right there. It's uh, the little spice garden for the kitchen. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go. Uh, There's a barn. There's that house. So, look here. You can brush your feet. Yeah. No way. That's My dad cool. used to have those. You don't know what boots. that was? That's for you cleaning your that's shoes. That's how I get you. Keep, horse keep, shoes. You, keep your boots you just clean. scrape your off like that and then scrape the sides. There is a beautiful trail that's not long. Do you all want to walk it? Okay. All right. It well, goes behind the house, through the cottonwoods, and then back up by the restrooms. Why not? Let's go. The gear wheel. That's neat. We need some exercise. Apparently there's 
rabbits. Oh, rabbits are everywhere. Jackrabbits and normal rabbits all over. Well, there's some gigantic jackrabbits around. The size of, probably with their ears, probably three feet high. Check out this fence. Hmm. It's like a serious fence. I was going to say snow fence, but... <laughs> And they don't have the Ocotillo up here to make Ocotillo. Over here in this part, snow fence. There. <laughs> also, another full house down that trail, up underneath those cottonwoods, too. Can you go in this one? Huh? No, you can only walk around the outside of oh, it. Oh, they put up plywood and painted it to look yeah, like windows because... They faced it out. They faced it. From a distance, it looked... But you can, you can uh, get to the trail back. Yeah. Water? Oh! It does have... Oh yeah, that works too. Yeah, yeah it did. <laughs> it must have been beautiful when those cottonwood trees were alive. I know. Wow. And they are dead. I told you they're enormous. They're yeah. just so big. Yeah. Yeah, the trail's right there. There's a little creek that runs through here, too. Well, there would have to be to support those trees. There's still a lot of lively ones over there. We would call this snake grass. See, look how big the truck is. Is that crazy? Wow. You know, you don't expect to see a tree this big in Arizona. Yeah, we are, they're not this big back home. Yeah, that's what I was saying. They're enormous. Yeah, we had big cottonwood trees where I grew up, but they weren't this big. Of course, as many years ago as that was that I was a kid, <laughs> they might be this big by now. <laughs> wow. Did you make it up? Yeah. I was trying to get up here so you could kind of see how... No, you're getting up there so I can take your picture. No, sure. Huh? <laughs> wave, at all it. The, wave at all the Jerry's fans. <laughs> hey, Jerry's fans. <laughs> Uh, it's pretty neat. I love cottonwood trees. I like them better with leaves, though. Me too. Well, so there's an airstrip so about a mile from here that they hold a lot of uh, dog shows and uh, an horse airstrip. shows and whatever Did, groups want to get together. They, they get the area. Oh, they have an airstrip. Did you hear that, Steve? They have an airstrip. So it's primitive. Steve has an airplane. Primitive airstrip. I don't know if it's active. <laughs> it's really cool so you can go back there, but there's so water should be back there because the water's kind of high, but we, we, the short, shorter way is this direction. This little, it you looks, go look? looks a little dry for water yeah. this time of year, yeah. Well, that's what I'm saying is it's actually there. You just have to walk over the hump oh. over there. It, it's a little standing, but there's some actual water back here. <laughs> that's like down in um, Oregon Pipe National Monument. You go back there to Quito Benito. Yes. You walk like you drive 26 miles on a dry dirt road. And then you got to walk another half a mile on a dusty road. And you get to this pond. It's a oasis in the desert. <laughs> Quito Benito. See that? You can see the ranchers, the ranch hand's house between the yeah. village and I love this walk through here. It's so pretty. It is. And, and then actually it's, all, it's better when there's leaves on it. <laughs> this has been a tour of the Empire Ranch House and Garden Walk. And I've enjoyed it immensely. Hey, Donnie, Luann, Hi. Rachel, Hi. thanks for showing me. 
<laughs> hey, tomorrow I'm going to post part three, which is driving off towards the Chiricahua Mountains. And we get to a large herd of bulls, and we explore a pond looking for frogs. We also get to the top of a hill where we can observe the whole area, four mountain ranges, and the valley between Tombstone and Tucson, Arizona, probably where Wyatt Earp rode through the valley. Come on back tomorrow. If you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today. <laughs>